Welcome guys, this is Joe here and today you're going to be learning how to make a Minecraft vanilla server on your desktop quick and easy. And in the next episode we're going to be taking that vanilla server straight over to Bucket and Spigot so we can add awesome plugins. So make sure you subscribe for content like this, I've got quite a lot on my channel. And make sure you like the video and go and maybe follow me on Twitter. But anyway, let's get started. So first of all you want to come to Minecraft.net and you want to come over here and click on the download button. Then you want to come down to multiplayer servers and you want to download minecraft underscore server dot 1.8.4 dot exe right here. And all you need to do is just download it. So while that's downloading you need to make a folder on your desktop just called minecraft server or whatever you want to call it. So uh, it has finished downloading so we're just going to put it over from my other monitor and now you got it. Just ignore that little one you shouldn't have one like that because I've already downloaded it so now all you need to do is double click it and you'll just get this little warning message it's completely safe as long as you download it from minecraft.net slash downloads you'll be absolutely safe so we're just going to um, click the little box so it doesn't pop up again now we're going to run but as you can see it just flashed now a few people do get worried here but that is one reason we need to accept the EULA so uh, yeah, let's go and edit, or you can double click it, or whatever you want to do with it. And now I do recommend to go to this link, this will not be in the description, because it's not for me to say about the EULA and everything like that. But now you want to come over here, delete false, and go to true. So uh, yeah, let's save that. And now we can double click it. And as you can see, it's starting up. Now, not a... The information on it doesn't pop up anymore. I don't know why, I think it might be a small bug. But it's okay. Now, every server I make and or whatever I do, first thing I type into the console before even joining is OP space your Minecraft username and I completely messed mine up then. So now I am Optum server. We can even click on the opt folder here. And there we go. I am opt. So um yeah, let's get into minecraft so when you're on here you you know you're going to click on multiplayer and as you can see here i've got a home server so all i'm connecting that is by uh, local host or you can go to direct connect and type in local host very simple join server and now i'm in so let the world first generate you might get a little frame lag i am screen sharing so that is a little bit laggy for me but first thing you can do is game mode one and uh, no one else will be do it, do that on your server. It's only you who who whoever you opt on your server. So if, you know, put it you know if I want to opt um, one of my mates. Oh, if I can get his name right. So now ARP97 is opt on my server. So yeah, that is nice and quick how to make a Minecraft server. And all you need to do is to stop it, come into the console and stop. Nice and simple, server closed, and you have saved all your world. So I hope you have enjoyed this video. Make sure you subscribe, like the video, share it, favourite it, go and follow me on Twitter. And I say thank you for watching. This is Joe from NDB Gaming, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.